Hello everybody and welcome to Jurassic World Evolution Return to Jurassic World Episode 2. Now, if you recall in the last episode, we did our first enclosure, which is of course of the Ceratosaurus, which has Bruton, Bill, and Terry. Oh, Terry's now the alpha. I thought Bill was the alpha. But, as you can see from when I last played this, there has been some changes that I made. For example, this river right here, which will be a feature for when I work over here. But right now we're going to be working on this enclosure and facilities over here. So, as I stated, this will be a massive herbivore um, facility, which, by the no, I do not have an enclosure uh, gate, so... What I'm going to do is put this here, and then, because I forgot to do this um, post-video, post um, we are going to make a facility, a pathway for the um, vehicles, so it will be easier for them to get to the island. To the, not the islands, the other parts. Now, let's get this. So basically, this would be like a, the perimeter wall of the enclosure, so... And now we'll go here. Well, no, they don't need... So this is, like, where the car's going to be able to get from in here to going out to the park. So, I think what herbivores we are going to have... It, uh, what should we have, guys? I know I want a sauropod because it's a really big enclosure. But what else am I thinking? Oh, and by the way, if you have any re I, requests for dinosaurs in parks, do leave them in the comments. Like, for example, um, over here, we're gonna be changing this part up, which we don't need this anymore. We're gonna be changing this section over here, plus a bit of this section into its own enclosure. Over here is going to be an enclosure. And I think right here will be like a little facility hub. I'm not sure. Maybe it'll... Well, it'll have a small facility hub, but I don't know if I'm going to make this whole spot. It. So, for these um, next enclosures, for the future videos, um, do leave in the comments which dinosaurs you'd like. And good grief, you three ceratosauruses are loud. And these two are still fighting. God damn it. Yes, Terry's the alpha now. I don't get it either, but you'll have to live with it. So first, I want to destroy up to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. The world's going to hell. We're going to get a zero star rate. Yeah. Oh, no, we still have a... We still have just under one star. Now, what I think I'm going to do is a circle here. Then have faci guest facilities here. And then viewing... Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Because I don't want to just have a straight line. That seems boring. So, let's get the pathway out. Well, we'll need more space. Might as well just... Okay, that's good. Alright, so... We want... One... I'll cut back to when I've made the circle, guys. So, guys, I just wanted to point out that I just realized how cool it looks when you have, um, or are making the circle with a thick path. Yes, I know how much money I'm making now, but, like, look at the, um, the, um, flags and stuff that are in the middle. They have a nice, satisfying look. So, like, this could be, like, ah, no, I'm speaking here. Just imagine, um, these are not, like, what they are, and then they're, like, signs directing you. If you want to go to this enclosure, 
please head on this path, or if you want to head to the sauropod sanctuary, please head this way. I just love how this looks, like I could just imagine this in the park, which is why I feel like um, Frontier, if they ever decide to work on this game again, because like basically they've said that they don't have anything that they're working on, which is very depressing, but just like a small thing like signs like this that go on the path saying, hey, this enclosure is this way or that way. Just little things. Now, I'm not going to keep this here because I already have an idea of what I'm going to do for the, um, the, the circle. So, just wanted to point that out, guys. So, guys, we have the circle here now. And now I think I'm going to, I'll just do the little art piece here. And then what I'm thinking is this section will just be guest facilities. That's all it's going to be. I'll, I might put like a little... Well, I don't really need a fence here, but, like, I don't think many people want to see the, um, large substation that's right there. Right here will be, like, a curve that goes onto the path, and now because of the size of this circle, I'm not going to put, like, the viewing points on right here. I'm going to, like, probably I'll do, like, a curve, some sort of curve right here, like, like, some sort of feature that'll... A path that'll make it curve this way and then like have the view and platforms there and then maybe some like right here because like this is just like a little blank space right here so just want to point the, my plan out for you guys in case you can't see what I'm doing okay guys sorry that took a little longer but apparently I cannot have water everywhere so who knows maybe um after this video I'll cut do a little c extra work and maybe I'll change it up to something else because I wanted to have water and but if you look at um if you go to water I wanted to try like I wish that it would allow like every bit that's not path to be water like it would look so much cooler but like this it just looks weird but you know what I'll keep it like this for now let's um, change it to dirt though so anywhere that's doesn't have anything will, which is basically nowhere so anyway let's continue on I'm gonna make first the um All right, so 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 now we just need to connect that. Alright, so... Because I want to have um, viewing areas over there, so I'll curve it this way and then swing it around. So let's...
let's see, we want to get this. So yeah, it's going to swing this way, and then the curve here will be um, mainly just the um, viewing thing. Viewing vents and towers for this side of the enclosure, and this side will have like the others. We won't have any here, it'll just be like um, low fences. Because they, they shouldn't break out. After all, this is Isla Matanceros. It's the easiest island. Like, literally, with the three Ceratosauruses, I was almost at three stars. And that's with no guest facilities, guys. So, yeah. let's just, um... So, we'll make this. We'll... And then I'll do like Can I fit a hotel in here? Okay, if I cut off, like, this section and just, um, do it a l Yeah, so this will... Okay, we'll place that there. Back it up. Hopefully we can back it up just a little bit. Come, yes. Oh, oh, come on. Let's get that right up there. So we're going to need to back it up a little. Ooh. Come on. There we go. Just a few light touches. And then let's go. What sort of light can we go? Oh, we got a disease. Bruton. Stop sniffing no some... Problems. Stop sniffing their behinds. Alright, so now... The goal is... We'll do, um... can extend this a little bit more if we need to for the um, vents. So yeah, like this will be a guest facility hub with a nice fancy path going to here. Yeah, this is turning out already pretty good. And this doesn't look too bad, but you know, I'll I'll change it if I really oh, Hold on, guys. Okay, guys, we've got the um, pathway set up now. 
now let's build the enclosure. So first let's um even this out and god damn it Bruton, quiet down. Alright, let's just lower it to about here first so we can build our enclosures. Let's um I say we do a pattern, so like one vent and then tower that can go over here Do one and two. So a tower, and then the vent, then right here can be um, guest facilities. So let's um. So wait, no. First, now hold on. What's the thing that's? Oh, it's the monorail. Thing. It's not. Yeah, 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 I know it's not connected. Relax. And now we shall do the vent. There we go. Now let's do one more. Right. Hello, Esme. Yes. Okay, so let's um, we'll do every cable one, and then we'll curve it. And then we'll go low here. Shucks. No. One more. And then we will go here. And then a nice straight. And then Okay, that should be good. They shouldn't be able to get out from there. And then
closing up the hills now. And we are going to... Well, first, let's go and start incubating these sauropods, because they take some time. But what sauropod are we going to do? I don't want to do Brachiosaurus on this one, because I always do Brachiosaurus, and I said I want to do more dinosaurs that I don't use a lot, especially for, like, the herbivores. I, like, use always all the carnivores. But for herbivores, I'm feeling like for sauropod, I'm going to go with Camarasaurus, as long as it doesn't want to be a pain in the neck. Either that, or it's going to be... It's not going to be... Mementiosaurus, because on this island that's a crazy idea. I'm gonna go with Kamarasaurus. And let's see, what skin am I feeling? Either rainforest or jungle. I'll go with rainforest. Nah, jungle. Shark. And more shark. Alright, that's 205 light. Plus, we're gonna get the paleobotany, so we'll do one more. There we go. And how many can you guys have? Nope. Okay, so you can have seven. So we'll do. We'll do five of you, because we also want to include more species. And then I'm thinking we'll do... Triceratops as one of our other ones for using on this... Unlocking on this island. So Triceratops. And then we could use one small herbivore in this. Or a Hatchosaur. I'm thinking we'll go with we'll go with Mysaur. So Triceratops, Mysaur, and Camarasaurus for this big enclosure. Now let's think about what we're gonna do. Well, for one, I wanna um, let's raise this up a little bit. Let's see, how would it go? Is it evenly out? Evened out? So you would turn this way, turn this way, and then straight path towards this. So you can go that way, turn, and there's a little bit of a dip, but it's fine. Then you go down, let gravity take you. Watch out for that. And then there you go. Okay, pretty good. <clears throat> Let's get this. I want to have a water source that's like visible from here, but not too much from there, so. Like tap, and I'm gonna make and then river coming from over there. And the reason why is because it's gonna be like an overspill, so like water's coming from down here and also down there. So, like, you'll be able to see the river section from here. Unless I, like, fill it up. Let's, um...
So yeah, like, there's a nice terrain dip. It's nice and hilly and, uh, incubation failed. Alright, so landscaping, let's cut up some of this water. Sorry guys, I'm a video video time cut out, so I had to I'm re -rec I'm recording the next bit. Oh, are, th are these in the range of this? Okay, so this one's just touching. So So yeah, we can have hotel there, hotel here, and then one over here. Well, maybe two. One pointing that way, one pointing the other way. Hopefully, unless it doesn't fit here, which should. Okay, so yeah, it, it does work here. We can just move it out a bit. So yeah, it's going to be pointing that way, which is the wrong way, I know, but I want to make it, I want to have the hotel point towards something interesting. So yeah, it's not like going to be appealing for like this part, but you know what? It's appealing for, like, the whole park, the park as a general, which, speaking of which, let's give it a light, and then, apparently it doesn't want to work this time, so. Okay, quick tap. And then we will go with a rock in the middle. Let's go with that one and then the tree, scenery trees. Let's try and get three. There we go. And boom. Nice fancy attire. What's out of power? Alright, so let's um, work on the paleo feeders first. And then we. So, yeah, tall paleo feeder. I want to have one. So. Three of them will go here. Well, no, two of them will go there. And then to make sure that they spread out. Alright, so. Because, oh yeah, we did we grow anything from here? No, we didn't. Okay, the final one's gonna be done. Just 
have a little... Let's have a few... One... And then a resting spot up on my hills. Okay, so all the plants are grown, so let's get all these sauropod ones. Choose plants. So, so ginkgo and conifers. So select, select. Select, select. Boom. Boom, boom. Confirm. And then one more. Confirm and then we'll send one of the... Resupply one of the... Request acknowledged. We'll send you... Oh, I did not upgrade them apparently. So let's upgrade. So ranger accuracy, ranger accuracy, scheduling, scheduling, scheduling. So, yeah. So we'll have enough just to do these five. Task. Task so yeah, right here will be open, and then like up here will be there will be spots of openness, but most will be covered in like rainforest trees. Over here too, like this part will be thicker. All right, so. Marasaurus is now entering the park, and hopefully it's not a pain in the rear. Please don't let it be. One second, guys. Need a drink. Oh god, the forced ride. Now I'm remembering why I don't use this guy. Because he needs a lot of forest. Oh, well, that was strange. The music just cut out for a sec. Maybe it's just me. But the music just cut out for me, guys. Oh, I can hear it again. Very low. I think it's just the. It's alright, baby. You go downstairs if you want. Too. So, this is me giving you both. Alright, so. A lot right here, and a few of these in between. Alright, so. The first one is down. Asset collection request received. Second one's down. Collecting asset. And it's a good thing the scenery trees do count as as brand new trees. Otherwise, this would be a pain. Oh, All right, so. En route to collect the asset. So we got five of these guys. 
Next, we'll make the Triceratops, and then the... Oh, wait, no, we're not having a Pachysaurus in this. I thought I was going to have one, but no. Alright, so, I will tranquilize this guy. And if you guys have any suggestions for names for these guys, I will gladly put them in. I'll always be naming them specifically one of each species myself, but like for the others, I'd love to get your guys' names. Be very appreciated here at Jurassic World. Alright, so first let's do the soil, because my thing with some of these is I like to have soil in a little cell, like especially right here, because I'm going to do like a lot of weeds and plants and stuff, so I want to have, like, where, like, where there isn't any, like, landscaping done, I want to have it be so that, <coughs> excuse me, when I place, like, the, um, shrubbery, oh, excuse me, um, when I place the shrubbery, it'll keep the dirt in some spots, that way making it look like, you know, it's not all turning not all just going to be green. Now let's see, how much do you hit me? Oh, great. Okay, so we're not doing too bad as a start. But let's make the... Um, so, like, in, like, where it's going to be really forested, it's going to be the thickest. But around here, let's go... If I was the jealous type, I'd be pretty jealous of how well you're handling things on this island. Well, thank you, Claire. That's a, that's a real honor coming from you. And also, Jesus, we are almost at four stars, guys. Maybe we'll only have a few, few episodes to do. I just heard a Brachiosaurus call. Very sure. Come on, you guys go get food. And what? So, let's see. Yeah, that's going to be a nice view. So, like, you get to look there. Look right in front of you. And then the tower. The tower you're going to get hints of dinosaurs. Which is what I want. I don't want them to be easily visible. Like, there'll be a lot of trees here in this spot. But, like, this one. Yeah, that's nice. You're going to get this part opened up. So, let's, um... Let's work on the trees first. Alright, so. And then what we'll do is we'll go brrr, we'll go around this like especially over here because like well duh. Now we'll go the coastal because I want to make it look very thick and not just like stocked up. Vibrant and then crag. And then, like, yeah, right under here, it's going to be nice and watery. And then... Yeah, so, not too thick. Like, this is just like a small growth that's starting. Now, you guys should be fine. Oh, of course you're not. What about you guys over here? Okay, so they're perfectly fine, but you need more over here, which means that... What about you? Okay, so he's fine, which means it's this one. Once you get to, like, this corner, you're in the tricky situation, so... I'll give it a little more trees, like...
like that. But that's it. If you come over here, that's your fault. You shouldn't be too annoyed. Like, he's coming closer and he's already- there you go, he's happy. He's gonna be unhappy for a second, but it's fine, they're- I know you've handled work like this in the past, so this contract should be right well, up your alley. Well, that's easy, because that's what we're gonna work on now. God, gosh, no, we don't want you, we want you. Let's see. Let's go, boom. And then we'll go all the way down. Go here. Now let's go here. So let's see how much guess. And then oh yeah, close shop. Let's see, right here. A little more, a little more, a little more. Alright, there we go. That's it. No, we do not want it pointing wherever it chooses to go. We want it pointing the right way. Alright, so first let's... Alright, so fancy again. No, we do not. So we got the main three. Let's have two bathrooms. Because, yeah, there's a hotel here. Now that one's not going to be too happy, but it's going to have some stuff over here. Yeah, like, that's super annoying. Like, literally... What's the strongest attack that I can make? Bounce. 102 and 72. Are you kidding me? That is just sad. Like, why? Why can't I make them, like... You know, just because... I, I think they need to do, like, a free thing where, like, every dinosaur can have equal amounts of, um, upgrades. Like, at least in... At least in the, um sandbox mode because otherwise it's no f fun because like for example I'm gonna be working on a battle royale soon but I can't I can't do any thing about the herbivores being so like weak basically Alright, so we'll have a... Oh, yes, I got an idea. We can spruce it up in here.
Let's get a bar, because people need their alcohol apparently. Okay, so bar. Yep, of course they can't go over paths, I know they will. So we gotta go with these ones. That is it for today's episode. We have done all of this section. We did the Jurassic World Evolution like ring. I may change that, I'm not 100% sure. If I do, it'll probably be a pattern that like allows there to be more water. And then in in the next episode I will I'll have the other dinosaurs on um, already being bred and then well hatched and till and then probably next episode we will work on this area which means we probably have maybe two more episodes maybe we won't even get to five on Metanceros because we got this section, this section, so we'll probably spit, we've probably got two more episodes, guys. But, if you even, I do want to remind you, if you have any name suggestions for the Camarasaurus, Triceratops, or the, um, Myasaurus, please leave them in the comments, as well as, um, an idea for, like, back here, because I think I'll do, like, one more enclosure here. Because I don't want all of this to just be guest facilities. Because that would just mean there's three enclosures. And that's not really fun. So. Leave those in the comments. But if you've enjoyed this video. Leave a like. And be safe. And until next time. I'll see you later. Bye bye.